Yeah, you guys want, some of you guys have been requesting me to go to war with these guys, but why do we need to go to war when they'll just do it, like, when other people, when other rebels will do it for me? What's the point? Like, what's the point? Oh my goodness. No. You guys, go crush, okay, go right here. I'm gonna go set a big gigantic war path for you, okay? Follow this war path. Okay, thank you. And I have more soldiers. I'm starting to know, okay, you guys go take over this land. That way we have it. You guys go take over this and go take over that. Okay, yeah, the only thing I do hate about is that the rebels, that our country doesn't actually pick up the rebels, so you do have to actually manually do that. Trouble is brewing with, with Belgium. Well, no one's really caring because that isn't the main focus of everyone's life. I mean, the main focus is kind of my entire war. Oh my goodness. Yeah, we're almost, almost there. We almost got all the Chinese men. More Chinese armies are starting to die. More Chinese are starting to get out of this. Um, my, flim my flimsy defense force is starting to arrive. Good job, men. Oh, shoot. We are so going to get totaled by the Germans. <laughs> uh, where is the rest of my defense force? Where did it go? Oh, wow. You guys are really slow. You guys need to seriously pick up the pace. Just a little bit. Like, we, we're starting to already do stuff. So, in fact, I'm just going to move this entire northern line over here. Over here. Because this is this is really where the battle is going to start beginning. And I do have more, my, do have more stuff than the Germans, but... Not, not in this. This is this is a little bit out of our range. Like I'm, I'm seriously thinking this might be a little bit out of our range, but we'll see, we'll see. But if I get gas attacks, this would be really nice. This would be insanely nice. Okay, let's see. So I'm, I'm hunting down the last um, Chinese armies. There's a Chinese army over there. Um, go send these guys to go occupy and go kill them. These guys, go send these guys to go occupy and kill them. Yeah, this is basically... Oh my goodness, what the heck? I'm trying to help you guys. Don't you dare provoke me. Okay, as soon as these guys are finished, I'll send them in one by one to go kill off these Germans. This is probably the only chance we're ever going to get to kill off these Germans. Because these Germans are pretty much as weak as they're ever going to get. Oh my goodness, this is like chaos. Why are you rebelling? Just go everywhere. Go everywhere. Okay. Basically, just go everywhere. Oh my goodness. China, you are a bigger pain than I ever thought you would be. Okay, hurry guys. So Russia's advancing. Russia's advancing. Please, somebody get over here. Where are my troops? Where are my troops? Come on, guys. This isn't that hard. You're crossing a mountain. Like, we aren't that stupid. We have mountains right in front of us. Like, right here. Okay. All you guys, charge! Save our men that might die or have dumb vessels. Vessels, vassals, whatever you want to call them. There's somebody to me. Okay. Okay, go, go, go. Go, 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 go. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Did you guys retreat? Mauji. Mauji, go to Mauji. So let's see, you guys will go to Mauji April 15th. April 16th, April 19th. Let's see if we can just do a massive attack and defeat these guys. This is probably not going to work. Let's see. Yeah, because these guys retreated. I don't know why these guys retreated. Oh, they retreated. Charge them! Hit them with a lot! <laughs> I, I, I'm probably going to lose a lot of men in this. I do not even deny. I'm probably going to lose a lot of men in this battle. But at least in the terms of, of sanctity, I will kill at least 12,000 Germans. I guess that's the kind of, like, thinking I have to do. I have to do massive conscript attacks. Chase them down. Do not let them escape. Because right now we could deal with everything else. Okay. The Russians are starting to get some of their troops back over here. And we're starting to get some of our troops back over there. Um, the only force I have to worry about is right over there. The rest of the Chinese forces are kind of lame. No offense, China, but your forces are kind of lame. Like, I, And why are these, what are these guys doing? What, the, what are they doing? I have forces right there. Okay, you guys, go right there. Another one, go right there. You guys, Russians, go crush that army over there. I'm trying to crush the rest of these Chinese forces, but... This is going to cost me a lot. I already know it. This, this is definitely one of those wars that I'll remember as be like, Yeah, this cost me way too much. 
But it was Russia, and I had to help them, and the army got destroyed because of Austria. I hate you, Austria, right now so much. If you had not destroyed Russia's army, we might have had a better chance. At least my army's starting to spread out, so we do have... It looks like we have a good defense. Okay, it looks like we have a good defense. Okay, against that, we have a good defense. Okay. We have a couple weak flanks, but I think in the overall terms of it, we could possibly deal with Russia. I mean, Germany. Man, why do I... I don't know why I mix those two up. They aren't even... Like, I understand why I mix up places that have, like, similar names or, you know, at least have the same letter, but when I mix up places like this, it's like, what the heck am I thinking? Huh. So, Germany's almost dead over here, which is good. Which means we might be able to get control of our country back. Okay, so let, let's spread back out. Kill off all these guys. And start reconquesting all of Burma. Our countries are fine, right? Yeah, we got, we got control of our country again. That's good. That's good. Okay. But over here, we're still trying to get control. Oh, we have to get control of this situation. This is, this is becoming asinine. We need to get control of these guys. No more. I'm done with this. Go kill the Chinese. Like, that, that's literally my attitude now. Just no more, go kill the Chinese. We need to get control over this now. There is no more, there was no more if, ands, or buts about it. We need to kill off every single one of these stupid Chinese men. Actually, I need you to actually go start heading over here because th you guys are actually good soldiers. Okay. If we're about to encounter the first German box. Oh, you got to be kidding me. You know what? I'm going to add that as a war goal. <laughs> Against China, I'm going to add that as a war goal. Put down Boxer Rebellion. Yeah. <laughs> Why not? Let's make sure that, China, that they won't be able to grow anything for a very long time. And they'll have to pay me, too. I like the sound of that. Seriously. Like, they, they not only are humiliated, but they also have to pay me. That sounds great to me. Okay. So most of the Rebellion problem has seems to be crushed. Some of it did free some of China, so I'm dealing with that right now. We have to we have to get back China's land that was conquered back under my control. Yeah, you guys just stop going around willy-nilly. Just go right there. Okay. Yeah, because they're going to make soldiers otherwise if we don't get control back over this. So, we have to quickly get back control of this. So, yeah. Kind of self-explanatory. Um, you guys go right there. Crush these guys. You guys go right there. See, we got Burma back under control. See, this is like, this is what I said. We're doing pretty good. I don't know how well we're going to do when this happens, though. Okay, you guys are way too much from the front to be in the front. We need you guys right... Let me see, how am I plan working? I can't actually see the regions. There we go. That's more color-coded. Um, yeah, we need you guys to be right there in Cherbul, in Chiskel, so that we can have a big, gigantic front. I don't think they're going to be coming so much from the north, because they're going to be too divided over here. We're just going to have to deal with these armies. Which, these armies, I don't think are going to be too hard. Because they're... Oh, my goodness. Actually, you know what? Let's go do something risky. Go attack these guys with that army. You know why? Oh, never mind. Never know why. Because that army's a little bit too big. But we're starting to prevent... We're starting to get a big, decent armies over there. I mean, we do have rebel problems, which is annoying me. You know, just slightly, it's like, really? I have rebel problems now of all times. Okay, let's see that. Any more Chinese armies? Okay. You guys. Go hunt down this Chinese army. You go hunt down the land. Okay, you guys. Kill these guys. Seriously, I'm not, I'm not even joking anymore. Just kill them. I want them all dead. I want them all dead. I don't want any remnant of the Chinese army to be alive. It'll make our job a lot quicker. Make our job a lot quicker. Okay. Okay. So let's see. Now we got this. Okay, let's see. How's the Western Front doing? Have they engaged us yet? They have not engaged us yet, but we have a pretty good force going for us. Like, we have... Let's see. 65, 10, 42, 25, 53, 83, 36. Okay, we have a pretty good force going for us. So we should be able to counteract whatever kind of war score they will have against us. Trust me, guys. This will end in a very big, gigantic defeat for them. But it will take a lot of my effort. And I will need... 
I will need to have what I need. Like, seriously. If that makes any sense to you guys. Basically, what I'm saying is I will need to have, um, um, gas attacks by that point. And if we don't have gas attacks by that point, we're basically going to be dead. Okay, so let's get this done with. Let's see, do we have any more men over here? Okay, we have more men conquering. We're basically trying to corner the... Okay, you guys divide. Because I know you guys are going to take nutrition, so... You guys. The army is not doing anything. Go right here. That way we have a good... That way we're kind of... That way we block the rest of the, um... Chinese advance. Okay, you guys. Go right there. Go crush these stupid Chinese. About Sinda. Kill the rest of the Chinese. That's all I want you to do. Armies are going straight for me. You know what? That works for me. <laughs> Make sure you kill these guys. Make sure you kill these guys. That's all I'm going to say. Alright. Let's see. How many armies do I have left? I have a couple good ones. We're basically trying to keep control of China. Because China is right now being a jerk. It doesn't want to be tamed by the mighty Indian nation. We are clearly the superiors in this city. Oh my gosh, they're coming closer. <laughs> I am really scared of them. They are coming closer and closer each time I look. They're like, we're just going to slowly inch up. Inch, inch, inch. The fifth right now, and I'm second. That tells you a lot about what's happened to the world. Alright, you guys. Um, I'm going to have you guys move right here. You guys move right there. You guys basically are cutting through the Chinese armament. Okay. We almost have it all under control over here. If this is if this starts losing, I know what to do. Send in more men! <laughs> That's basically my strategy. Send in more men! Oh, this must be an actual advance. Oh! Ha 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 ha! No. These guys are gonna die. Do they have gas attacks? They do not have gas attacks, I just have major disadvantages. Okay, well then, these guys are going to take a little bit more men to go take down, so I'm going to use my actual special troops. Um, yeah, I'm just going to start sending more and more men to the front. Holy shoot, they are really close. They are, like, really close. I'm going to start seeing battles here very, very soon. Alright, you guys, I'm going to spread you guys out over here to Ostlis. That way we get that. Um... You guys, we're going to have to finish up all these Chinese guys before we move up. Before we move up anymore. Seriously, we, we really will have to finish up everything. Almost there. Fortune the bold! Yes, I don't care. <laughs> you think I care at this point? No. I lost a lot of armies, but doesn't mean... Oh my goodness, there's still more men over here. Go kill these guys. Man. Russia, how did you... Oh, my goodness. Okay. My defense force is almost ready. I wish we had gotten um, gas attack capabilities. That would have helped us. Okay, I'm keeping a good-sized men over here. Um, this army is going to divide. And then it's going to go over the hills to help my men. If there is any more men over here, basically save off death. I don't know how well we're going to do in defense mode. Because right now... This is a big army. This big army is heading towards us. With more advanced equipment, but more advanced staff. But I will stand and fight them, even if I die. Which actually is very likely. Because of Chinese. All because of Chinese resistance. This is like the Chinese resistance. It's annoying me. Like, they can't just... You know what? You, go crush these guys. I don't even care about the rest of them. Yeah, I know. I lost that major battle. Whatevs. So I lost a battle that... That I really didn't care about. Whatevs. I mean, come on. Do they? Uh, doesn't even matter. I have 52 more men coming, and they're more elite than these ones. So yeah, this army's going to die no matter what. Wow, this army is doing insanely well against me. Like, just insanely well. You know what? Just just retreat. It isn't worth it. That is definitely not worth that many that many deaths. Why do I have this army just sitting here? Go this way. Go kill more men. Uh, and more Chinese rebels are starting to spawn. This is annoying. This is quite annoying, but quite realistic, so I like it. 
Okay, and Mongolia is starting to become slowly in my sphere. Which is good, because they should be in my sphere. We're friends, we're bros. Okay. Persia, not gon going to die here soon. Uh, increased opinion. I can't actually get any of my troops, any more of my troops over here. I basically have as many troops as I can get on the front. Which stinks, because they aren't very good troops. And the Russians are just stupidly sending in their troops. Like, that isn't smart, Russia. What are you doing? Like, seriously, I, I don't know what you guys are doing. But, okay. Okay, let's see. You guys are retreating down there. Chase them down. You guys go right here. You guys go right there. Okay, we got more of our men. Russia's starting... I think they're just starting to get into this. Like, we're just starting to re... Okay, where's that last... Oh, I think we defeated the last Asian force. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we basically defeated all of the, the Chinese men. We just have this... This is the last big Chinese force. I'm going to go crush that one. going to crush this one. Then we're going to go send our men to go crush that one. Which... You guys go down here. Go rest up. Go get some more troops. If we have any more. I don't think we have any more troops. And why do I have to send so many men to keep the Chinese guarded? That is just asinine in my opinion. Okay, maybe this, maybe that mechanic I was talking about earlier is more annoying than anything. That's what I was talking about. That's what I was thinking about. I mean, it's good and realistic, but it's just like annoying. It's like, really? I mean, I just got these guys conquered. Do I really need a rebellion right now to make it even harder? Like, seriously, the Chinese. Look how hard it is to conquer the Chinese. I just won major battles. I don't need more. Oi. But I'm, we're almost there. We're about to get our biggest challenge yet, which is dealing with the... Oh my goodness, I wasn't paying attention! Shoot. Okay, the first battle is being fought. I don't even think there's any chance of me saving these guys. Let's find out. What kind of numbers are they hitting? Oh, there is a chance. Okay. All you guys, go in. Yes. Okay. That should balance out those guys. Do I have any more backup troops coming? No. That is not a good sign. And you know what? I'm going to let China burn. <laughs> I don't care. I care more about this battle over here because if we can start pushing back the Russians, this is going to be more crucial to our survival. And I love, and I love what I did, but we're really going to have to start pushing back China a little bit more. Okay, this over here. Almost done over here. Almost done. We're so close. Kill these guys. Kill these guys. Don't even let them... So we're going to let them do what they're about to do. Kill these guys. Because I know the AI will not. And we're going to have to deal with more if we have to do that. Okay. Over here though. Let's get back to this. I know I just probably sent more death men in. I don't really care. Because you know what? We have to kill as many as we can. We might even get lucky and get army directionalism from this. Because I mean, we got to be really close. I mean, we just... Okay. How close are we to gas tax capabilities? Right. When are we gonna get it? Has clocking as You better I, I mean I'm I'm not even kidding guys. You better discover this. We are basically in a very life or death situation here. Ah oh, dang. We're losing so much Oh I hate the Germans bonus to morale! It's so unfair. Ah oh. Okay. I'll calm down, but we need these gas attacks to spawn here very, very soon. I mean, it's extremely soon. We don't have much reserves. The Germans are just going to kick us all the way back to our own land if we do not, if we do not get ahead on this. The lucky thing is, is though, that Germany, I mean, not Germany, oh, yeah, I won't be able to guard these guys. I'm, I'm, I'm a fool, I'll fool myself if I try to guard these guys. I do can do this, though. Okay. And would they, would China naturally accept a big, gigantic peace deal? Because seriously... I, I, I've, I've conquered them. No. They're that stubborn that they don't want to accept a peace deal. <sighs> okay. They are 13th place right now. They have nothing. And they don't want to accept a peace deal. What the heck? Okay. I'm going to have to move in right there. And whatever. I'm going to have to move in right there. Okay, well guys, I don't know how long this has been a recording, but 
I might have to say it, but unless we get gas attacks, we are not going to win this war. I know. This sounds like a very, very shallow. This sounds like a very shallow thing to say. Like you know, manpower is supposed to count into this, but this Victoria 2 is not built that way. Victoria is built in a way that if gas, if you don't have gas attacks, you will lose this. I could fight the Germans for as long as possible, and still lose because I don't have gas attacks. So we have to hope and pray in the next episode that I get it. Otherwise, we're doomed. Or what I'm gonna have to do is hope and pr is that British aggression in Gilderland? Good job. Good job. No one seems to be helping the mighty empires over here fight as we slowly die and slowly turn. But yeah. Already the Germans have pushed through and have destroyed one of our barriers. It wasn't even like a real challenge for them. That is not good. So anyways guys, I thank you guys for watching. And I'll see you guys next time. Testing, testing, one, two, three, or one, two, three, or one. Two, three.